Tech. What a good boy. Come on. working with a horse that while she was trying to take her saddle and everything off um, broke the pole she was tied up to and stepped all over her foot so her foot is essentially just bruised to pieces she sent me a picture I will not subject y'all to that horror um, but anyways uh, I actually know the horse that she's talking about and that horse tried to bite me when I tried to tack her up she has a serious mare problem as some might say um, a lot of things they've tried to do to see if there's something like going on with like ulcers or whatever uh, it's inconclusive sometimes the mare just is being ugly anyway horse spout threw me off one time literally was bucking up and down like a bronco in the arena and almost fell off but I didn't I held on <laughs> anyway so today we're gonna just do some exercises and things to work on some stuff in the arena kind of like we would with a lesson and I thought I'd bring y'all along good boy all right so the arena obviously needs some work done <laughs> um, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take these barrels because there's no point in them sitting here you can see the ground um, I'm gonna move them somewhere flatter that ought to be enough room and we're not gonna do the barrel pattern but what we are gonna do is work a work excuse me on circling around the barrels 
Oh, great. This one's full of water. Ugh. 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 Get up. Come on. Just far enough. I can get up. Good. That should be enough room. This one should be easier to handle. Make sure there aren't any creatures living inside of it. Before I pick it up. Let's see if this one's full of water. Nope. It's empty. We're not going to do that as soon as we get on, but I at least didn't want to have to worry about that. Look at him sitting there. All good and patient. What a good boy. Alright, I'm going to jump on. Alright. Just do some things to get ourselves awake and moving. Oh. <laughs> him turning, paying attention to me. That's what we're going for. Just some response. Hopefully it won't get too dark before we're done. Good boy. It's just a squirrel. Don't freak out. Just a squirrel. The first week I had him, the squirrel did that exact same thing. And um, he freaked out and wouldn't go near that half of the arena until I finally made him. Then he got over it. So, that's progress. I'm going to do a circle. Trying to use a lot more body language, a lot less rain, to get him to understand what I want him to do. So when I want to do a circle, I just kind of turn my body, my shoulders. And he actually responds really well to that. That's one thing my trainer and I have realized is that he responds really well to body language on the barrels and everywhere else. Uh. 
easy. Easy. Huh. Walk for a minute. It's really dusty in here. Now we're going to work on the barrels. And what we want to do is we want some curvature around the barrels. Keep that nose kind of pointed at it, but we don't want him to drop his shoulder either. switch sides and do the other way. And it might take a minute to get him to get in the right place. So I might have to circle the barrel a couple times.
That's all. That's all we're going to do today. Whew. Man. That was probably a pretty good exercise, I think. Oh, sorry. Keep going. Just taking my feet out of the stirrups. Just to relax. Listen. Anybody who says this is dangerous. Well, if something goes wrong, I should be able to either get off easier if there's no chance of me sticking it, or I should have better balance anyway. But that's gonna be it for today, guys. Um, as far as riding goes. Oh, see the squirrel? See the squirrel dash? Oh, do you see the squirrel? Do you see the squirrel? Oh, there's a squirrel. You see it? Good boy. I'm too tired to freak out. You just ran that saddle into that branch. work out that much. I know Rio, I'm gonna let you out in just a minute. I know. It's so horrible. You can be patient. Whoa. You gotta, <laughs> I know you're tired, but you gotta lift your head so I can actually put this thing on. There we go. <laughs> Look at 
you. Aren't you just precious? I know you're tired. Ooh, you want me to hold your head up? You like that? <laughs> Say no. No, I want you to put me back out in the pasture where I belong. Put me back out in the pasture where I belong. Good and sweaty. Can't say you didn't get a workout. <laughs> sweaty boy. Got some gurgling going on. That's a good sign. <laughs> you can't be hungry. Well, I mean, horses are always hungry. You know that expression is hungry as a horse. Well, there's a reason for that. What a sweet boy. You're so handsome. Of course, all my horses have been good looking. Aren't you good looking too, Rio? But get me out of here, woman. All right, so we are done for the day. Um, I've got Dash all unsaddled and brushed and, <laughs> and sunscreened. He's one of these. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to go take him and put him out. Um, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, there are going to be some other videos coming up. I actually have a plan for a baking with Brattle coming up and another costume one that I'm working on right now. So I'll see you guys next time.